Back from the brink. Bancho, what are you still doing standing in this stinking hallway? How long's it been, man? Five years. Five years. I hear the boss is looking after you, though. Yeah. Same way he's looking after you. I ain't never done time for the big man. You're a fucking legend around here. No. It's not hard to keep your mouth shut. Hey, tell me something. You gonna let me in this place? You're already in, my friend. <laughs> Hey, <laughs> why am I the new kid? Mate, you've got the tools to protect us. You're not doing so bad, are you, Chucky? I prefer Mr. Fowler, Jules. Mm -hmm. Oh, hello. Mr. Fowler. I'm here to make a pickup for Mr. Centre. You're working two jobs for the old man. Why, well, are you the only one he can trust? I just do what I'm told. Good old Julesy, eh? Thanks, <laughs> <laughs> hey, mate. I hear that your girls are dying. So what about it? So what about it? So when can the chooks come out to the farm and see what it's all about? I thought it was Mr. Fowler. Julesy. No, mate. It's me. Yeah. Okay. Well, you get a ride to the farm when the boss says you can go to the farm. Mr. Santin. Why don't think he likes me, mate? Doesn't like it. He lets you run this place, doesn't he? Well, that's why I think he doesn't like me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I thought maybe you might like to stick around, hang out with us for a while. Sure. So, Mr. Fowler. You got something for me? Ah, oh, yeah, business. Russians out with you? No, Rodney. I left them at home. Oh, they sure are nice looking ladies. Yeah, right. As if one of you clowns get a trip to the farm. <laughs> Mr. Senny sent me and Rod out there last week. Shit! Fucker! What the fuck am I doing wrong? What the fuck are you doing right? 
Mike Fowler. <laughs> hey, Mr. Sandy wants to see you. He's got my number. Anyway, boys, I've got to go meet someone for breakfast. I'll right. get him to call you. You do that, Rod. Vernon? Josie? Fucking Fowler. Fuck. <laughs> 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 I wish you had been that face. <laughs> but I don't know, it was a fucking thing to say. I don't know, all I wanted to know was that I enjoy your company and I'm, and I'm getting crucified. <laughs> I hear you've got some entertainment planned for us, mate. I certainly do. When do we go? We can go whenever you boys are done. Oh, you finished? Let's go. Yeah. Alright, we'll go, but, uh, Mark, uh, Yeah, mate. Do me a favour before we go to the farm. What's that? Change that fucking shirt. <laughs> oh, try a new breakfast, not spoil it all. Oh, I get so lost, were you alright? Alright, we ready to go? Yeah, let's go. You made it. For a second I thought it was off. The girl's ready? Yeah, I just woke them up. But this new girl, I think she's gonna be trouble. What about the bar? Is that ready? Yeah, bar's ready and lines are cut. And I'll bake the cookies. For the, everyone. Good. Get the girls, I'm gonna set our guests. with this place, haven't you? Yeah. yeah. And of course... Oh! oh, oh, oh. <laughs> well, they're on their way, be patient. I can assure you gentlemen, there are no fat, ugly ones here. Yes. Because I am the love. The love man! Get a load of this guy, will you?
imagine picking flowers in the orchard. It works for me. Thanks, Jules. No problems. Yeah, I'll have to listen to that all the way home. What do we owe you? No, it was on the house. No. No, oh, please. It was a gift from my employer. We look after each other here. At least use the money to buy my present. We appreciate that. Thank you. Jules, come to Melbourne soon. And look me up when you do. Will do. See you, Jules. All the best. I really like them boys. I'll send you to Melbourne then. <laughs> Fuck that. It's too many Greeks. Anything you like? Oh, no, I was just making sure. We are all here and accounted for, Julian. Give you someone to race. Get this one on there. This was wrong with this car. <laughs> Bit late for a visit, boys. We're not here for fun. We've had our fun. <laughs> what happened to her? She tried to take a walk one night. <laughs> What's happening here? Take him inside. It's all right. Come on. You want to come home when that's been? <laughs> oh, look, Stevie, she don't want to play with us no more. <laughs> you better put her in the cage until she gets comfortable. She likes to wander. What am I going to do with a girl like that? Whatever you like. We did. <laughs>
Stand by, sir. Can't stand my shoes on here. Yours look pretty sharp. Well, they set you back. <laughs> this bloke is a bad set fuck with. Ask me to move the dog. I thought I heard you say thank you for shooting the dog. Did you see me shoot? It was far away, man. I shot the dog. You moved the dog. Do you know who I... Don't. Why are you getting upset, man? You don't want to upset me. You don't want to... You make me mad, Jules. Just, I don't want to have to do this. You want this one or this one? Oh, stupid! You just punch the wall. Anastasia, where are the bandages? <laughs> I broke my hand! If anybody cares, I've broken my hand. Girl! <laughs> Here we go, boys. Being a runner's back. That's right, Sienna. Where's the fucking bees? How do we go? Do we get audio? Couldn't get a bug in the girls' rooms. How are the others? No, he did all right. The three got in there appear to be working. Where'd you go last night? Did you get to see the bitches? Red hot. They got a new one. No, she sounds Polish. Polish chicks. Can't stand them. No, I do. I like all girls. But they'd like you as cutesy. <laughs> you got no choice. <laughs> Come on, boys, let's concentrate on the job. Dara's boys for Mr. Senti. Yeah. <sighs> so, I hear Senti wants to talk. You know, the old man likes to keep tab on things. Well, he's got my number. That's what I like about you, Julian. That's what the old man likes about you, too. Say what you mean. <laughs> Another thing I mean to say, I don't like the way the handlers are bringing in the merchandise. Well, if the girls get roughed up, it means they've got spirit. Gotta break that spirit. 
Well, breaking spirits one thing, breaking legs is another. I want a vodka and ice, and get a stinking bourbon here from a friend. Straight, no ice. So, you remember Senti's nephew, Con? <clears throat> Con, never met him. Lucky for you, just got out of the clink. Been away for eight years, raped some poor Catholic schoolgirl. It's a long time? Yeah, not long enough. You put a knife in her. Sounds like a nice bloke. Whatever you're about to say, don't say. Santi wants him to come down and work on the farm. Another bourbon, please. Don't worry about it. Sure. Let's turn it into a daycare centre. Luca, mate, if Santi wants me gone, let me know now before he puts a bullet in my back. Julian, you got it completely wrong. The old man loves you. He fucking hates Con. Thinks he's a waste of a fuck. He's hoping hanging out with you might pull the dumb shit's head in. I'm not one bit happy about it. We've got a good system out there. I mean, Vince. He's next to useless, but we get things done. And the girls, I mean, they, they seem to be... Enjoying themselves? Well, no. They're just happy with the current situation. What exactly is the current situation? And what exactly are you trying to say? We'd hate to think you'd be getting a bit soft on us when you're old lady. So this is what it's all about. The old man is sending out this con to toughen me up. Hey, you don't have to take it personal. Luca, my friend. I'm not emotionally capable of taking this personal. And you tell Senti I'll ring him when I need to. You really think it's a good idea to let all the girls out at once? Where are they gonna go? Where's the new girl? Uh, I don't know. Right, all of you, get inside. Now! TV. You can watch the cricket. Oh, and chocolate. Oh, I've got chocolate. Ha! Are you fucking serious? I beg your pardon? You think you can make friend by buying TV for us? Go stick your fucking food, you coward. You say we are free. But we are not free. We are caged dogs for you and scam my you to fight! Thank you for food. We will watch TV. Sure. I promise. So that's the way it's gonna be, huh? Sure is. Okay with you, Fetty? Uh, you know, the territory set pretty fair. As long as you let us know whenever you are. My ties are um, a little girl, just fine. That is, of course, until we expand outside. We keep those a conversation for another day, isn't it? Fuck your conversation for another day. Luca, cool it. It's okay. You better tighten the leash on your dog. It's got an attitude problem. <gasps> Thanks, Fuzz. We'll be in touch. Cheeky little son of a bitch. We can't afford their problems at the moment. He doesn't respect anything. Yeah, but forget about Fetty. Tell me, how's Julian going? I'm glad that boy's back. Well, he's not too happy at the moment. What's his problem? Steve and Alfonso bought a new girl in the other night. She's alive, ain't she? Roughed up. Is that okay? You think maybe we could ask the boys to take it easy a bit? Yeah, good girls are hard to find. Wrong, Luca. 
Getting them to come here, that's the easy part. Getting them to stay, that's the hard part. Jules had the Cardaris boys over the other night from Melbourne. Yeah? They have fun? Apparently. They bought that for you. Oh ho. It's heavy. Got that game with the Muscatillos and Giorgio son on tomorrow morning. Good. Hey. <laughs> I want you to make sure you look after Julian. He's pretty good value. And please impress on him how important the farm is. Ever since they've ordered our accounts, the farm's been our only source of income. They're trying to get me for tax. I feel like bloody Al Capone. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, remind him about the farm and tell him to keep a close eye on Fetty. I want to know what that streak of Gullican shit's up to. I saw you know we do with dogs like this. Julian? Why aren't you asleep? If I sleep, I'll only have to wake up. It's not such a bad thing, is it? No, I guess not since you've been here. Why do you do this job, Julian? Well, there wasn't much else on offer. Vin says that the boss, he, uh, he owes you his life. Vin says that he lets you run this place as payment for keeping your mouth shut. Well, maybe Vince should keep his mouth shut. Vince is just a stupid little boy. And useless. Useless.
deck. Well, I've got three on, so I guess it's another four, five, six. <laughs> you see, I lie well. It's the truth I have trouble with, but lying's fine. Oh, you got to know when to hold them. Know when to fold them. Know when to run away. Know when to... What sort of place are you fucking running here, Jules? Mad bitches like that should be fucking locked up. It's alright. I'll go downstairs. We'll get you another drink. I'll get you another girl. Fuck you and fuck your whores! You tell Sandy in this place is fucked! Your whores are fucked! <laughs> I wasn't supposed to be like this. I know, darling. They said it would be fun. They make lots of money. Come on, we've got money to spend. The big winner, yeah. Pablo! Yeah. Hey? Yeah. That's what we're doing. Good. We're betting money! Yeah. Looks like the cavalry's arrived. Come on! Settle down, Vince. I'm your cousin, not your whore. Sorry, man. Hey, Jules. This is... Con. Yeah. Don't get up. Boss says I've given you a hand. Then I guess you better do what the boss says. Oh, I'll show you around then. Man, oh, you just Shut look up, Vince. You look massive. How'd the card game go the other night? Made you 7,000. Seven? That's good. Any uh, problems? Nope, not with the game. Vince called me. Said there was a problem with one of the girls. Oh, did he now? Is Tatiana pregnant? Looks it. Well, the boss is pretty pissed off. What, so I suppose that's my problem now? Yeah. What's this? That's where you're taking the girl. Melbourne. That's why Con's here. Listen, uh, boss thinks you're a little bit overstressed at the moment. So what? I'm out. Just the opposite. Thinks you need a little break. <sighs> I'll take a break when I'm dead, Luca. Settle down, John. Get the girl to Melbourne. Get the job done. A couple of days, you come back, everything's back to normal. Vince and Con will take care of things while you're away. They're just a couple of babysitters. Just a couple of boss. You're in charge. Why Melbourne? Well, the city doctors have an extended leave at the moment. Daris boys owe us a favour. This bloke's the only bloke we've got at the moment. I'll leave tonight. While I'm gone, you're in charge. Get 
want the bitches to get inside. What the fuck are you doing now? I'm getting the dog. Leave the fucking dog alone. Hey, Cootsie here. Louie. This is team leader. Who is Julian leading? Fuck, I've got to get to Melbourne. Oh, he's going to be a bad start on you. Fuck! Hammer it, Louie. Oh, it's all right. I needed a wash anyway. Besides, I had to make a wish. Wish what? More wishes. Boss sent me. Yes, in. yes, I've spoken to the boss. Come in. Should I send my assistant to fetch him? No, I'll take care of it. Yeah, I'm sure you will. Tariana! Ah. Open the door. What are you doing? Don't. No. Come on. Oh. 
Open the door. Go and give him a hand. Come here. Good to see you, Jules. What brings you down my way? You all right? Yeah. Yeah. Is there something wrong? No, I just needed to sit with a friend, that's all. Well, I'm here, mate. You can tell me anything. You got something you want to tell me? No. Oh, yeah. The scent he loves his present. Good to hear. A long way to travel to tell me that. Oh, no, I'm here on business. The girl. All right. You do the dirty work as well. Something like that. Hey, Louis. Did you ever just stop and wonder how you... Ended up where you are. Sure do. Just the other day I thought that. Yeah. I sometimes think that if something had gone right in my life, I wouldn't have ended up here. It's not your fault you ended up here, Jules. It's called survival. You gotta do what you gotta do. Yeah. I suppose so. I just... If you know something's wrong, do you? You still do it? That's what makes us all different. Some do good, some do bad. Which are you? Me? I'm just a bloke trying to do good in a bad situation. Well, at least you're trying. Yeah. Just try harder. between you and me, right? Absolutely. Yeah. Well, God, have a long trip ahead of me. I better get going. Thanks, Lou. No worries. Shut up. He 
even looks like the real thing. It's not working. No, it is working. You're just not winning. Boom. Bing. How are we all this thing is the sound? How are you fucking on that? Oh, it's just, it's like the real thing, but like better. Bing. Boom. You know why I'm winning? You know I'm winning. No, I'm winning. That's me fucking winning. No, I was the one on the left. You were the one on the right. No, you are. If you want to swap sides, you need to sit That's there. That's me, number three. It three works nil. the way you were sitting. What are you talking I, about? You, you don't know. You are not good at this. I'm the one that's in front. Three, con, you, you zero, no, you Vince. Are, you are losing. I am not losing. You are I'm losing. Winning. I'm fucking winning. You are, okay, you're winning. Thank yeah, you. yeah, that's sure. Better. Sure, my name's Con and I'm winning. Oh, that's you it. Are, Slow down. You seem surprised. No, you, you're just not meant to be back yet. What are you washing a car or something? <laughs> Jules, it's all right. Con just told the girls needed a wash. <laughs> hey, please! <laughs> yeah. Ah, look at that. You like that? I said, have you been put in charge? Come! No. Then do yourself a favour and turn that hose off. I'm giving the girls a wash. And this is how we did it in the old days, before you were here. So if you don't like it... Fuck off! Turn that fucking hose off! Guys, just relax. Shut the fuck up, bitch!
Hey boss, it's Julie. I'm good. Yeah. Oh, Fetty? What does he want? Uh... Don't do that. Are you leaving? I'll be back later. We won't wait up. How's your holiday? My holiday. Yeah. Well, you mean jail. Yeah, your holiday. Remember yourself, three meals a day, big guys staring at the little eyes. You love my bit. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm just joking, all right? Fuck, you're so serious, man. Yeah, I moved up. I'm fucking two from the top, man. I ain't a nobody no more. I did hear that. Well done, Fetty. Fuck are you looking at? You fucking looked at me. It's alright, Fetty, don't worry about it. It's just a punk. You know who I am? Oh, fuck the ass out of that. What do you think? Yes, Fetty, she's very pretty. Not as pretty as some of them bitches you got down the farm, though, eh? What about tonight? Check out with you, don't look at that What the fuck? Ah, they're just like normal. Yeah. Why don't you go to one of the brothels around here instead? Fuck those bitches. Wanna come to the farm, Jules? Come on. Something about giving up to a chick that doesn't look like that. No, I don't. No, I don't. Please, please let me come out. I'll be polite. No funny stuff, I promise. Alright. Fine, I'll take you out. Fuck yeah! <laughs> Do me a favor, though. You've got to behave. Yeah, man. That's what I'm worried about. Check it out. <laughs> Where the fuck are the chicks, mate? Did you come in this room here? Sit down. Nostalgia. Fuck, there's only one. Then I get a choice here. Just one, Fetty. Who the fuck do you think you are? I'm someone you shouldn't be fucking with. What's your fucking problem, mate? My problem is what you did to that girl! Who gives a fuck? I give a fuck! Do you know who I am? You don't treat me like this. You're drunk, Fetty. And you're gonna get in your car. And you're gonna drive home and you're gonna ring up tomorrow. And you are going to beg for forgiveness! Guys, just relax. You stupid piece of shit. I'm a main man, you fuck! What the fuck's going on here? Scumbag. And you're a dead man. You hear me, 
Jane, Julian. I'm going to kill you. And I promise you, I'm going to rape all those filthy fucking sluts. And I'm going to beat them until they're dead. <laughs> what do you think about that? <laughs> 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 Julia! Julia! I'll show you what we do with dogs like this. I'll show you what we do with dogs like this. <laughs> <laughs> Luca, Julian, we've had a problem out here with Fetty. Well, I wouldn't have rung you if there wasn't a problem. Please, I need you to come out here. Jules, Anastasia's hurt really bad. So we're going to dance floor. I hope Anastasia's okay. Calling this one, boys. Ring it in, we'll take Luca. Oh, shit. Fetty didn't do this to her, did he? No, I think she did it with the glass. Oh, you crazy bitch. You're all right, quickly, I need someone to... Call the doc and someone to go get me some sticky tape or something. I'll call the doc! Did you say sticky tape? What? Yes, sticky tape. With staples, rubber bands, fucking something to help me stop a wrist bleeding. Are we going in? The TRG won't be here for another 40 minutes. I'm going. You two stay here and monitor. I can't wait to see the look on Lucas' face when I take him down. Vince! What? I'm calling Luca! I found this stuff. Well, good, what'd you get? Sticky tape and super glue. She's not a model fucking airplane, Cotton! Rip the sheets or something! Vince! Yeah? What did Luca say? He said he's bringing the doctor. Is that all he said? Yeah? Vince, are you still on the phone? No? What the fuck's he doing? He's scared of blood, you know, he'll pass out. Hey, hey, So where's Luca? No, oh, he couldn't make it. He sent me instead. Did you hear that? Luca's not there. It's just Julian. Surveillance one. Luca is not in the building. He sent someone else. Louis, do you read? Fuck. Doc, what can you do for her? Looks like you got to her just in time. You are very lucky. Yeah. Yeah, I'm lucky. Is she going to be all right? She will be okay. Lucky with sticky tape. Is there someone else that is hurt? Don't you worry about him, Doc. You just worry about her. So that's Fetty. Mm -hmm. Well, what happened? I was told him to keep an eye on him, so I met him out for a couple of drinks. <laughs> well, he didn't tell you to cut his head. Uh -huh. How are we going to fix this? I'll have to use the phone.
Vince is driving my car and needs to follow me. I'm driving Fetty's, and the other's in the boot. And the dog, well, he can go anytime he wants. Oh, and Jules. Just don't kill anyone, eh? Let's go, Vince, my boy. Let's clean this up, okay? Come on! No mention of us. Uh, no mention. You got away clean. Good. We're going for a drive. I think something bad happened to Fetty. Do we know what? He's in the boot. <laughs> something did happen to Fetty. The gang could kill you on murder charges. If something really did happen to Fetty. Still not enough. Julian ain't worth taking down. He's not a big enough player. The car's leaving. Maybe we can get a tail on him. Get lucky. Call it in, Cootsie. Yeah. What's going on? She is unconscious, but uh, she will be all right. Come. Would she go downstairs and clean the kitchen? Thanks, Doc. You have to start respecting these women. What? You've got to protect these girls. Well, they're protected. Thanks for your concern. Really? You have taken every liberty from these girls. The least you can do is give them back some protection. They look to you for that. You are their protector. Because all the native birds will, will like eat him. He is like us. What do you mean? No, there's not. Well, if I don't, the pup Jim Judy show. <laughs> yeah. Well, isn't it a happy day on the farm? I just get jewels. <laughs> no need for that, Vince, my boy. We're here to see you. Me? Yeah. Seeing you did such a bloody good job the other night. The boss thought it'd be a good idea to send you on another errand. Well, with you guys. Who else? <laughs> <laughs> well, come on then. Let's make a move. Oh. And you might need the cool. Careful, Vinny! Don't shoot your cock off. Boom! <laughs> 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 Where are 
they going? Town nice and close, I want you to wait for me there. Just go. This one skipping down the driveway. We told you to lock her in the fucking cage. <laughs> the bitch killed Con! to be kidnapped and raped and then shot in the head. And the boss wants to see you, Jules. Why? Who did you ring? Well, no one. Luca rang and I told him about Con. He was pissed off, man. How come he wouldn't wake up? I tried to wake you. What did Lucas say? He didn't say much. He just was quiet. I don't think he believed it. He must have told the boss because he wants to see you though. Guess I better go see the boss then. Sorry, Jules. 
This is new. Why it is. It's no accident. It's bloody incompetence. Oh, I put her down to prison. Some men just don't come back the same. They lose it. Hey, boss. Hello, Jimmy. Roger. You wanted to see me? Yes, Julian. Take a seat. Julian, Julian. What's going on out at the farm? Three deaths in three days. One of them, my nephew. The other were a whore. And Fetty, for Christ's sake. We all hated Fetty, but we didn't want him fucking dead. And it was all over a girl. He was beating. Oh, don't give a fuck. These are important people. The more important things in life than the front teeth of a bloody whore. That's three life sentences for someone. And I'm bloody sure it's not going to be me. You're going to take the blame, Julian? Well, I'm not going back to prison. Yeah, I thought as much. So what am I going to do? I'm going to close the farm. I'm going to move the whole operation. That costs time, costs money. A change in location would be good. We could get a fresh, clean start. Oh. Is that what you think? It's just a suggestion. And what do you suggest? I tell Fetty's parents about what happened to him. Why would you tell Fetty's parents? You were seen as bar. They're going to know that you were the last person to see him before he went missing. No, I wasn't seen. Oh, yes, you were. I got it from one of my contacts that Fetty was under surveillance with the fucking police. Now they know. He was at the farm and they know where he is now. David got pulled over and they checked the boot. Oh, fuck. Fuck doesn't even begin to describe it. Now, everybody knows what happened to Fetty and where. And pretty soon, his people are going to want payback. Well, they won't touch you. You had nothing to do with it. I know that. You know that. But they don't. You're going to start a war I can't fucking finish. A lot of mistakes, Julian. No, no, no. We'll just deny that we ever had anything to do with Fetty. No, Julian. I know how to fix this. They're going to want you. No, don't do this. Julian, you're like a son to me. But something happened to you in prison. You used to be clever. You used to be smart. What the fuck happened to you? I grew up. So all this was silly little games to you. But I've outgrown this shit. Oh, sorry to hear that. But you see, we haven't grown out of it. This is our life. And now it's your life. Don't do this. You give me no choice. This is gonna hurt me more than you know. But it has to be done! not to do it. We'll move the farm. You, you, you can run it anyway. Uh, Any way you like. The hobby farm is closed for business. <laughs> Hello mate, Jules. Hey, sorry about the time. Hey, you know that, uh, you know that favour you owe me? Where can I cash in on that? How's today? Yeah, I'm no good. I need to lay low with you for a while and I've got to get out of the country. How many favours? That's it, mate. Yeah, no, I can reach you tonight. Six o'clock. Okay. Please do me a favour. Make sure you're there, huh?
Tack! Just relax and let me finish this puppy. Louie! Someone just shut up the club. Julie was seen you earlier. That was a gunshot. Well, I think Julian's on a rampage. Is that for trying harder? Coots here, we have gunshots on the farm. Was that a gun? Get up. All of you get up. <laughs> and help her. What are you doing to us now? I'm letting you go. Is this a joke? No, it's not a joke. You're, you're bleeding. Please, come on, everyone, let's go. We've got to go. Where's Tatiana? Tatiana's dead. <gasps> Been shot, Tatiana, last night. Oh! <laughs> Fuck you! I think you were dead! Come on, let's move! What are you doing? Quick, quick, quick. Come on, squeeze in. Okay. Don't stop for anyone. And keep this car. And shoot anyone who tries to stop you. Take it. Take it. If I'm not there in an hour, keep going. Do you understand? Yes. Well, then stop looking at me like that and go!
funny, Luca. I thought you had more friends than that. you do it, Juliet? You're my best friend. I trusted you. No, Luca. I was your best friend. Was. You lied to me. The whole thing was a ruse. Why, man? Money? Huh? Retribution. You people left me to rot in prison a long time ago. You could have got me out with one piece of information, but no. You let me face that all on my own. We're looking after you now, aren't we? <laughs> this place is worse than prison. What happened to the Julian I used to know? That Julian died a long time ago. That Julian died today. go to hell, haven't you, huh? Should have picked that dog up days ago. Yeah. Good help's hard to find. Louis. How the fuck are you? Ha, 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 ha. 
Nice. Nice, you lose.